What's going on everybody? Lamar Fashion is back with you and talking a little Porsche today. Porsche Final Run by Hot Wheels. Uh, I've got two of the, I think there are three. Let's see. Got the Carrera. Let's see, it says Final Run. Porsche 911 Carrera. And I took this one out of the huge blister it came in. The Porsche 911. Now in a previous vi uh, video, I cracked the first casting of the one you see in the blister. This is the first one. It was a new model, uh, 89. That's just sweet. This is probably my favorite Hot Wheels in my collection. And I think this is a black wall. You guys, please quote me on that. And it's the only one I have. I think that's correct. But this is cool. But let's get to the cracking. First, I want to crack this Porsche Final Run, the 911 Carrera. We'll take a look at the back of the card. These were the other castings that were done away with. Apparently they say goodbye to them. We'll go ahead and take a look at this. And apparently they also destroy the tools. So once they're done, they're done. So when the Porsche series comes out, we'll be looking for that to see if either of the two castings that I'm opening will be available. But according to K5, I think he told me this was originally a Corgi. It's got a weird base. Anyway, let's crack it. Take a look here. Boy, this thing is heavy. I've never actually cracked one of these before. I sent two of them to Nesto, and here's the final one. And let's take a look around the piece. This is really cool, you guys. I wonder how this would do in a downhill because this has some serious heft to it. They, Hot Wheels, or oh, Mattel anyway, they made this one at a loss because there's a lot of metal in here. That's a lot of zinc. Let's take a look at the base. You can see it's got some oxidization going on, but that's cool. I, I actually like that as a as a coin collector. I I like toned coins. I don't have any. I, in fact, my coin collection is gone. I hit a low point in my life and had to get rid of all that. and That was very painful. But anyway, back to the piece. This is a cool piece. Very heavy. Um... If I ever do some downhill, I know what to use. Diecast Racer X, I recommend this in a downhill if you're ever watching. I'm going to send you a message. Uh, if you have one of these careers, not the, it doesn't have to be the final run, just one of these Hot Wheels careers, I'd like to see how it does. It's even got some suspension, you guys. That's pretty cool. It rolls nice. All right, now we'll take a look at this piece. The Porsche 911. Here are the other castings in this series that were canceled. I really want one of those uh, Mercedes Benz Unimogs. I don't have any of those, and I don't have a Hot Wheels uh, BMW 850i either. But here's the Porsche 911. Let's go ahead and crack it. And we'll take a look. I don't crack them clean like you guys do. Let's see, come on. Let me crack this one off camera, you guys. It's giving me a little difficulty. We'll take a look at this casting and we'll compare it to its original casting. First off, it's a pretty casting. But if you look right away, I think they got the steering wheel a little wrong. Uh, the steering wheel is basically tilted into the windshield and uh, I don't know how you're gonna rotate that steering wheel. That's gonna be really difficult you guys but that's a good looking piece. I really wanted one. I had no idea this whole giant wheel thing is going on. Um, please comment below. You guys are uh, my experts for Hot Wheels. Let me know if that's a variation, because that, you know, I'm sure that's not what they intended, but this is a good looking piece, 
I really dig the wheels and the color. Very nice, the paint job. It's also got some extra details. Let's take a look at the original casting to see the difference there. Oh, it's not a difference. I didn't notice. See, I'm not in my game, you guys. But that's really nice. That's actually very cool. Take a look at the bases. Very nice. Very cool. Well, you guys, I hope you enjoyed it. You know, you guys know I always enjoy cracking Porsches. And I especially enjoy sharing it with everyone. If you guys have any questions or comments, please leave those below. Please feel free to subscribe. Thank you so much for watching, everybody. Take care. God bless you. And peace.